We spent several days at Arlington High School observing classrooms and talking to students and teachers. They all spoke of the hurdles to the building and learning, but also about overcoming them, each making their own way in a less than ideal setting. A look now at our series, Inside Arlington High School. Students often noted a lack of room to collaborate or simply get work done. During free study periods, the library is the most popular place to go, but often fills up fast. The alternative, going to Old Hall, they say, is too open and noisy. In the classrooms, students say they're too cramped, and overall, the look and feel of the current school just gets them down. But the high schoolers have learned to rise above their circumstances. They say now they just want a building to support the education that they are working so hard to get. I, I know that the vote about the building is coming up and gotta say that's a big factor when people ask me yeah. about my school and they're like, oh, the beautiful, the beautiful pillars at the front. And I'm like, you should see the inside. <laughs> it's horrible. It is objectively a little bit run down and that does get in the way of me giving it high praise. I think people will look at the price tag of the school and be like, whoa, that's crazy. Like, why are we spending all this money on the school? But I think the importance of having a school that people are excited to go to and feel proud of and are happy to, to go to, I think is really important. We also showed students the architectural rendering of what a new high school would look like. It would feature an open front lobby with meeting space, a library learning commons above, discourse lab and new gym with an indoor walking track. Here's the reaction when we played the video rendering of that proposed new school. What? That's nice. Okay, here we go. That's big. Ooh. Here's the gym. Ooh, it's probably fun. See <laughs> We will have more of an inside look at Arlington High School in the upcoming weeks. Back to you.